Hey guys. <coughs> uh, today I'm going to be playing Primordia. Uh, it's a point and click adventure game. Uh, I've had it for a while. I think I got it maybe one of the Humble Bundles? I don't really remember, but... I love the graphics already. That was like a big, uh... A big reason I wanted to play this game. Almost there. One oh. more setting. I love it. I don't have to read. I mean, I do. Not out loud. I don't one have to read out loud. So the unique is operational. One down, one million to go. Speaking of which, boss, I found exactly none of the parts you wanted. A whole day at the junk pile, and all I turn up are a locker and some stupid conduits. Maybe next time. Uh, boss, are you sure you got those settings right? Maybe. That came from down in engineering. Let's go. Oh, your name is Crispin. What the were blast I exit? came from engineering, not the deck. Oh, okay. The graphics and everything would kind of remind me of uh, Beneath a Steel Sky. There's no time for that. Well, just There's take no it. You don't know. We need to get to engineering. What if you need the gospel later? Reach out here. I guess we're going there. What do, you, what do you do? Oh, it's a cutscene or something. Uh, boss? What the hell? What is this high tech sorcery? Who the fuck are you? Crispin, get behind me. Oh my god. Who are you and what It's you a high tech want? creeper oh. from Minecraft. I think he wants the power core, boss. Stop right there. This ship belongs to me. Forfeit. Enemy. Wonder. I don't think he's too keen on private property. Get away from the power core. Forfeit. He... blazered me. You son of a bitch. Motherfucker. <laughs> Ship too. Horatio? Come on, Horatio, wake up! Oh my god, my name is Horatio. Oh. Ooh, you're okay. What happened? Well, Big Ugly threw you out of the ship. And then he said plunder again. And then he left with our power core. That bastard. Sod. Yep. How much charge have you got? Ten percent. You? I'll be fine. We just need to get the emergency generator up and running. Or we could just go to Metropole, city of glass and light. Free energy for one and all. Don't believe everything you hear. Metropole is trouble. But if you want to go, you've got free will and a maglev unit. With that guilt subroutine you put in me, I wouldn't even make it halfway. Actually, with a 10% charge, you wouldn't even get that far. So I suggest we get the generator working. <sighs> you and your projects. Alright, well this looks fancy. Can Christmas. I pick that up? Now, come on. Data I must pouch? have dropped the data pouch when I was thrown out of the unique. Facade, its memory got wiped. Easy enough to have the good old junk pile's coordinates back in, though. Okay. Is that a gumball machine? No, it's a no, robot it's head. it's a robot's head. Ah, uh, I wanted a gumball. I don't even think you can eat gumballs. Can I, I take it? I can't move this without some kind of crane, which I certainly don't have time to build now. Nothing worth salvaging. Okay. I can't pick that up. Yeah, alright. 
Alright, I guess we're moving. Ooh, what's that? Conduit? It's a okay. Of Gordium electrical conduit. Map data. Oh, what do I the just data do? Pouch is the data pouch. Okay. Oh, I can fast travel. Oh, that's kind of cool. But all right, we gotta go back there. Crispin, when I told you to find a new spark plug, did you just shove my conductive putty into the old one? Uh, maybe. <laughs> no wonder the generator isn't working. At least the putty is still good. Silly, silly thing, him. There's supposed to be a power-bearing conduit between this socket and the ship, but I never got around to putting one together. Didn't now we just get a conduit? It's not going to do anything until the generator's fixed. Uh huh. All right. Well, let's leave then. Cable. A sturdy cable. It's always good to have. What's plating? Oh. It's the unique's tag. Without it, I'd have never known the ship's name. Apparently, building a giant airship doesn't require proper spelling. Apparently not. Yeah, I don't know if I'd get... Uh, I, I was going to pronounce it eunuch, actually. I can't just scoop it up. Some very sticky... Uh, ladder? Oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, knock it off. I guess we're going up the ladder. I don't see another way out of here. There's no way I can reach that. More Gordium conduit. Okay. And there was no way to get up there, right? Yeah, not yet. This is no time for sitting around. It's too dark to see the ladder rungs. What if I exit on that side? Can I pick that? Why can't you just walk there? There's no way I can reach that. No, wait. Where's my inventory? No, this? Okay. Futile. That's never going to. Man, you suck. Stop you. Don't I need a conduit I'll for need that? I'll get a closer look to see how... I'll need at least five pieces to be able... <laughs> Wait, what was up there? I just saw it. A hose? I've tried patching this a dozen different ways without success. Blast oh, can we use the putty there? Blast? As much as I'd love to fix that leak someday, we have more important things to do. Plus, it would be a waste of the putty. Hmm. Oh, I can't do anything over here. There's no way I can reach that. The hatch is unresponsive. I'm just not sure. Uh, I don't. You know, boss, if you're ever wondering what I would do, feel free to just ask. I'll keep that in mind. I'm asking you. Sorry, boss, I've got sand in my audio receptors. I'll let you know when it's out. There's no way. What if I can make him get that? That's way too big for me to get, boss, and you know it. Did you grab that lantern? Sure thing, boss. You know, I always wanted to be able to fly. That's why I built you with a maglev unit. Not so that you could store tools on hard-to-reach ledges? Well, that too. There's no way I can re- Ugh, I don't understand why he can't just knock that over, too. It 
it's too dark to... No, not petty. It couldn't hurt to bring the gospel of man with us. Going to pray for a miracle, boss? Maybe. Maybe. Our man's miracle, Crispin. Let's hope that's enough. So that's where you keep it. Why were you looking for my plasma torch? No reason. This is no time for an- I still don't see- Because you have a flat bottom to rest on. Uh, boss, were you- <sighs> Yeah, whatever. Wait. She I can't pick up. that up. Can he pick that up? Is that really the best idea you can come up with, boss? Maybe. That's crazy. Good thing there's still some power in the circuit. Uh, boss, shouldn't you have thought of that before coming down here? We could have been stuck. I could have just ridden you back to the deck. Really? No. Routing that much power to your maglev unit would cause it to explode. Yeah, right. Sorry. I couldn't find a working fuse to solve the problem. I'm a floating bomb. I'm a floating bomb. Sweet. Alright, calm down, you. No! I don't know that it would take me back up, though. Go back down. The controls for this hatch are unresponsive. Did I get the torch? Oh, I did. Without power from the ship, the telescope won't work. Bad timing with those repairs, huh, boss? Why wouldn't the telescope not work? That doesn't make sense. Welding those parts together would ruin the generator. What about using the plasma torch as a spark plug? Uh, when I want engineering advice, I'll consult a manual. Damn it! Talk to me. Hey boss, what about trying to open that lockbox I found earlier today? Maybe someone buried treasure in it. That's right, I do have that area that I didn't even go to. It's locked tight. But I thought we were gonna use the plasma torch. Let's see get it if this together. Works. I love this game already. Is that a spark plug, boss? Who locks up a spark plug? Er, uh, actually, I think that box was some kind of machine. You killed it! Recycled it. <laughs> it's three pieces of Gordium conduit. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking Unfortunately, about. Unfortunately, one of them is completely corroded and worthless. Balls. There's a piece of Gordium conduit way back there. I can't reach the conduit. Wait, can he? Crispin, can you go in there and get that piece of conduit? I suppose. Good guy, Crispin. Ugh, I am such a sucker that for these graphics. would have been a lot easier with hands, boss. It's just scrap. Locked tight. So wait, can't you just cut it open again? It's a reinforced steep balls. Better just to leave it alone. There's nothing worth I picked it clean. So there's no way to actually get here except for fast travel? I understand now. work until they're locked together. How would that even work? How do I lock them together? Five segments of Gordium conduit. Futile. How Wait, would that stop. Knock it off. What if I mix I those? I doubt that will have any. Time for a little welding. <laughs> I'm a genius. 
Wow, that was easier than I thought it would be. You don't know. That's right, now I gotta get the spark plug. Futile. Oh no, there. There's supposed to be a power bearing conduit between this socket and the ship, but I never got a. Oh, that's right, I just welded them together. I didn't actually use them. Lovely. I thought we were in trouble when Big Ugly stole our corn. But just like that, problem solved. The problem is not solved. Well, I agree. The noise leaves something to be desired. This is an emergency generator, Crispin. Well, it was an emergency, boss. It only runs for a few days, if that. Oh. Well, do we have another one? No. Which means it still is an emergency. Well, in that case... First tips on the recharge station! <laughs> you need to calm down, little dude. So, what's the plan, boss? Their ship the looks weird, it's like melted power. wax. Or we could just take the train to Metropole and live in luxury! First of all, there is no train to Metropole. And second, even with full charges, we can't just walk there. But more importantly, I hate that city. It's in my core logic. I don't know why, but I can't change it. Okay, okay. In that case, can't you just make us a new power core? Yes, but I need some kind of strong energy source for that. And you just make one of those, too? I'm just asking. No, but somewhere around here are the plans for an energy sensor. That's awfully convenient. I designed it a long time ago, before I made you. I even found a sodium iodide crystal to use in the sensor. No man alone knows where it's buried now. Alright, Chiba, get out of my way. So where exactly are those sensor plans, boss? If I knew, we wouldn't be searching for them. And you're the one who always nags me about leaving papers lying on the floor. Okay. I can't pick. Yeah, you couldn't pick it up. How do you lose a crystal, boss? If I that's why I put it somewhere you wouldn't find it. You can't hide something shiny forever. Aha! Here's the crystal. Right under our noses. That is, if we had noses. Which you don't. I've never been able to figure it out. Any books? I don't need any of these right now. Let's no. hope it stays that way. All are equal in Metropole. Equal parts of the... Weary wanders, come. Join I bet us I can find a better use for this plug. City of glass and... But now we can't listen to the sweet voice of Metropole. I guess that makes two birds. Yeah, screw that. Nothing more to do with it. LCD. Okay. What's going on here? Notes? I found this in the dunes. It reads, Pound pastrami, can kraut, six bagels, bring home for Emma. The original designs for Crispin. Hey, there are arms here! An awesome set of tractor treads! I went with a maglev unit instead, and I never could find good arms. There's the design. I'll put the keynotes into my data pouch. How does it even work? The crystal pulses when it absorbs energy. The cable carries the pulse to the computer. The computer decodes the information and displays it on the monitor. Uh, boss, where are we going to find a working computer? The unique is full of them. Oh, right. The energy sensor requires a sodium iodide crystal connected to a cable, which in turn needs to be connected to a CPU and a monitor. Okay. It's Crispin's to-do list. Funny how it never gets any shorter. 
That's your Bob fault, Bob. boss. Not mine. Ooh, a rag? We're gonna make a Molotov? Seriously, did like my ships just melt? I don't get it. Wow, first the power core and now a rag. This is not your day. I don't think that would be wise. Wait, wait, wait. I don't need that. How do you know? The only way I can use this is by plugging something in. A universal socket for plugging in peripheral hardware. Okay. So what if I combine the, the plug is not that universal. It only attaches to electronics. Fine. The monitor is designed to socket directly into a CPU. It fits, but there's no point unless I connect the plug to something else first. What would you connect it to? That's never going to work. I need something to hold it in place to carry the charge. The cable's far too long to be useful. The cable's far too long to be useful. It's not finished yet. Futile. The monitor is designed to socket direct. Yeah, I know, I get that. It's not finished. What else would I combine it with? It's a plug. Oh, you suck. I'll need to get a closer look to see how. What would you do? Very. F what are you doing? I salute the flag of Horatio's clumsiness. I guess we need to go get the rag. I don't think that would be wise. There's no way I can... Hopefully, finding the power core will be just as easy. I doubt it. I can't move this with... I can't pick that up. There was... Yeah, okay, there's nothing here. Stupid rag. Making me work and shit. Feudal. 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 Oh, Jesus Christ. There's no reason to cut that. Feudal. All right, so now well, you've got all the parts except the computer stuff. Maybe you should start putting the sensor together. Crystal connector cable. I'll need to get a close. It fits, but there's no point unless I connect the plug to something else first. Uh, what are you gonna connect it to? I don't know. This? Are you really trying to build us an energy set? Crispin, I built you from a bunch of garbage. From spare parts, boss. Spare parts. Okay, The now... cable's far too long to be you. You piece of shit. I doubt that will have any effect. A simple computer interface with... The monitor is designed to. The cable's far too long. The cable's far. It needs a plug. Oh my god! I have the plug! A long cable with an interface plug on one end. How would that even. That's never going to work. Why not? Oh my god, okay. 
So you, what do you have to say? Now? Sorry, boss. I've got sand in my eye. Well, you've got all the parts except the computer stuff. Maybe you should start putting the sensor together. Crystal connector, cable, CPU monitor. Where am I gonna get a monitor? I've never been able to figure. Telescope control panel. There's a display for entering topographical coordinates. The telescope. Damn, where am I gonna find this? This thing at? I mean, it's saying a monitor. I have a screen. The monitor is designed to socket directly into a CPU. Ugh, I don't know where I'm gonna get a CPU from. That's the problem. We're fine on energy. He said that the... He said that we're full of them. Well, you've got all the parts. nothing I can do with it until I have some kind of power source. Hmm. Totally unilluminating. Man, I'm really like at There's a no loss. Reason. Let's cut a little cable off. Are you fucking serious? That's what it took? Well, just goes to show. Garbage in, greatness out. socket for plugging in peripheral hardware now we just need to check out these coordinates but didn't you just tell me we don't have enough power to go walking all over the dunes no I said we couldn't walk to Metropole anyway most of these are close by but what if it's picking up no oh, I don't know a radioactive rust monster a what or a giant cannibal robot there's no such thing or an unexploded bomb I highly doubt that or a giant lightning storm okay you're right we need to know what's out there before we take off. It's just a matter of figuring out how. Why is nothing easy? I can think of one reason. Mm, all right, wait. 651, 817, and 608. Let's see if I can put those in the telescope now. Sensor detected an energy source in the junk pile. Maybe we should go look more carefully. Uh huh. What did I say? Six, five, two. Nothing but radioactive waste. We can't salvage anything from that. And then what did I say? Eight seventeen. Looks like a giant cannibal robot to me. It looks promising, is what it looks like. 
And with that, poor doomed Horatio stuck his head into the giant's mouth. All right, let's go get the other three uh, coordinates. Alright guys, uh, I'm gonna take a quick five minute break and I will be right back. 